a spring chick, and I am so, okay, can you tell I'm excited? Okay, so part of it is the sun is out, yay! Okay, see, part of it is I'm not really good when the sun's not out. You can kind of see, and I usually am all bundled up, but I'm really excited because things are coming together for the travel suite. Okay, so we want to give you something different than all the news you keep hearing. Or would you like to hear about gun control? Well, meanwhile, we're going to bring all the cam on with comments on the headlines of today. A lot. And it's all over for the Republicans. Oh, yeah, because Boehner this morning, he made a deal. Well, where are we going to raise taxes? We're going to raise taxes at 39% on every, all the millionaires in the country, which went over like a lead balloon on everyone. Because not only, he, he basically, we're going to raise taxes on millionaires. We're going to give Obama a blank check to spend money. And there's not going to be any cuts. <laughs> You know, uh, they said that was a no deal for all the Republicans, the people that basically want a deal and the people that don't want a deal. I mean, it's, they said that was, I mean, um, they, okay, Harry Reid, they said, Harry Reid and Mitch McConnell said, we certainly don't agree on many things, but that was the most god-awful, asinine thing that anybody ever came up with. Well, we're going to raise taxes and, and deal with the fiscal cliff next year. After the, after you went over with, they're going to deal with it, which made no sense to anybody. Oh, you know what I'm starting to think about? Cigars. Yeah, I'll okay, we can do that too. Yeah, I just thought of, oh, excuse us, but of course we're, we're busy sitting there thinking of different things. Um, we're actually working things. on the travel suite at the same time. We do multiple, we have multiple businesses, folks. Yeah, so if you get things interjected, well, guess what's on our mind? Oh, besides news, and New Jersey Democrat Cory Booker Wayne runs for governor or U.S. Senate. I know, well, because, okay, let's put it this way. Not since the Reconstruction have there been as many people running for Senate's governorships and House seats as there is in the black population right now. Because uh, as, as Jimmy Fox said, this is our effing country now and whites can go to hell. Mm -hmm. He actually has said that they should kill all the whites in the country. They did? Oh God, I mean, he is really, Jimmy, okay, let's put it this way. The only award Jamie Foxx is ever going to get was the Oscar he got. Uh, and he'll never get a nomination again because uh, he hit on Django. You know, the, you know, the one thing that was really wrong was that Whitey put me in chains, but then I killed all the bastards in the movie. So in that, he doesn't, he, his opinion of the people that hire him is unbelievably low. They'll never hire the man again. I mean, you're not going to hire a guy it says he wants to kill you and your children. Mm. And New York police fatally shoot man brandishing pellet gun. Well, the problem is, is that it's not that they shot him. It's that the mm. officer that shot him didn't know he had a gun, period. They shot him in the back and never saw that he had a weapon. Okay, here's a question. Okay, we're going to tell people a little secret about the police. My father was a police officer for from the 30s until after the Kennedy assassination when they were really getting stupid. He said that you're always amazed at how many people that are killed in the line of um, uh, in, in the line of an officer's duty end up with shots to the back of their head. Mm. In giant garage sale, Japan's TV giants hawk three billion dollars of assets. That, yeah. Uh, what? Uh, NHK is in trouble. NHK? Yeah. Well, I mean, I They're, remember... Aren't they owned by the government? No, NHK is probably... Is a, is, remember, it's what was one of the world's largest companies, but the problem is, is that that uh, they got too big and they got too expensive. Because remember when we... Remember when we went to the one thing at the NAB where the head of the... Where actually the president of Sprint Communications said, anybody see... You know, my wish list for Christmas is a 75-foot semi down below with the NHK equipment in it. NHK basically have been, have been doing 3D without glasses forever, but they, they have sucked so much money in the development that the company's busted. Oh. Yeah. Search intensifies for New York City shooter video released. Oh, yeah. I mean, you got, okay, it's a pro. Guy walks right up to a person, uh, shoots the person in the back of the head, and keeps walking on. They don't have a face shot. He knew that the person, the cameras were behind him, so he always walked this direction and then walks up. Bang, and then continues to and walk away. And continues on. Yeah, and the cameras from across the street don't get him because he was shorter than the guy that he was shooting. Isn't that an amazing thing? Which meant he knew he was. A, it was a total pro professional hit job. They they waited to the guy. 
they took, followed him from, I think, California to New York City and then hit him right where they knew they could hit him without getting identified. Oh my God. It was God. so fast that nobody knew what happened. He just, you know, walked up, bang, and just keeps walking. That's the pro, folks. And people go, are going, huh? What, what happened? happened? And before they realized so he was they already heard, gone. They heard a noise, but they basically were using a silencer. So it's just, a, that's it. Oh, that's, yeah. Yeah. Florida judge keeps GPS monitor on Trayvon, Trayvon Martin's killer. Okay, the guy's not, they, they, they said, okay, there, there is no, what happens is they're not going to convict the guy. They all know they're not going to convict him. The grand jury couldn't, the grand jury wouldn't even indict him, so they're not going to get anything. What they keep trying to forget is the guy is not white. They tried to make him out. They bleached his pictures out. The guy's a Latino, folks. Mm -hmm. And uh, he basically had, they showed the pictures of the, uh, okay, we didn't have this little, 18, this little teenage kid. They had this guy, this big hulking giant that beat the hell out of um, the person. And he got shot by accident when he was being beaten. And former Florida policeman executed for 1986 killings. 1986? I know. Well, the problem mm -hmm. is killings... Are, uh, there is no statute of limitation on a murder. If they find you did something, the problem is evidence degenerates. You have a problem after so many years of getting somebody to testify. This time they still had somebody alive that could testify against him. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, uh, Walmart. I know, it always makes you wonder, like, what happened that now they decided to come across? Oh, well, no, it's just when a person, okay. Uh, a lot of times people, what happens is they, they don't want to testify when they're younger, but when they're getting old, they get a guilty conscience. Uh. It's the guilt that basically gets to them. They saw it happen, did nothing, and it was a police officer that did it. So they, the guilt builds up in them, and then they come forth. It's not, if somebody comes forth and says, you know, well, I was eight years old, and I saw my father machine gun 250,000 people on a lifeboat, they don't buy that. Mm -hmm. And Walmart CEO says fiscal cliff affects U.S. shoppers. Well, yeah, you know, because nobody is, um, the retail sales suck, which our economy is booming, but retail sales suck. And Obama backers turn from re-election to fiscal cliff fight. Well, yeah, you know, they're not going to, okay, nobody can understand what's going on. I'm going to give you a thing from uh, no less than uh, Representative Rangel. He said simply, you know, he said when you have a presidential candidate in the last week, when the last two weeks of an election takes vacation, and you have a conservative speaker of the house all of a sudden take vacation of his senses, mm -hmm. something is wrong. Mm -hmm. And the Democrats think they're on a roll because they got 51 percent of the vote. Ooh. No, they got 51 percent of the people that voted, and only 33 percent of the people in the nation voted. An Oregon mall shooting appears to be lone random rampage. They're almost all lone random. This is I, I last night listening to the experts talking. He said the they're almost all of these things are not thought out. They're random. They're spur of the moment things. Because if you sit and think, you don't go do it because you think I won't get myself killed. Mm. And Senate seeks sixty billion dollars Sandy aid, and Republicans eye a smaller bill. Yeah, he's already eyeing a smaller bill because they sort of found out that none of that money was going to the people that lost their homes. It was all going to build green infrastructure. Oh. Nothing was going to rebuild. The guy said, you know, eighty, you know, originally eighty billion dollars, and not a dime of it's going to build any three build. It's going to simply, well, we're going to go green, and we're going to take advantage of of, the, of this because, well, if we get eighty billion dollars. The government will then match the $80 billion and we can build green infrastructure. Well, the mashing went out the window yesterday and he's now talking about, well, we need to do, we need to worry about green infrastructures after we rebuild the homes and the businesses. <laughs> yeah. And gun control gets unlikely backers in Congress. Oh, these supposedly guys, okay. Uh, here is a the thing, they found out that some of these Democrats and Republicans have said that they were, uh, uh, NRA supporters and gun rights supporters, uh, they basically found out they don't know the difference between a magazine and, uh, and, and, a, and, a car, and basically and just self-loaders and they said, well, you know, we're going to have to ban these big magazines. Well, no, they aren't a magazine, folks, they're clips. Mm -hmm. The magazine is like the great big thing. 
a clip, to, and they, they, don't, they didn't know the difference between clips and magazines. And the one guy said, I don't think the guy's ever part of a gun in his life. That's the, you know, they show pictures of the senator from uh, West Virginia shooting, shooting. They didn't see him hitting anything, but they showed him shooting. He couldn't tell you the difference between a pistol and a rifle. Isn't it like? He said, they're all guns, aren't they? Well, no. This is a gun. This is a rifle. Aren't they all guns? No, they're not all oh. guns. A gun is something you hold in your hand. A rifle is something you put up against your shoulder. It's called, um, um, you know what, a, a rifle is basically secondary referred to as a long, uh, as a long gun. Oh. A long gun, but it is not a gun. Animonte bubbleism for the Mark Twain of the animal kingdom. Uh, okay, that if everything looks strange, it probably is. There you go. You know what I thought of?